Okay, so I'm gonna try to go to bed early. I'm gonna try to go to bed. I'm gonna try to go to bed early today. 오늘은 좀, 나 오늘은 좀 일찍 자려고. 저 오늘은 좀 일찍 자려고요. I'm gonna try to go to bed early today. I'm gonna try to get some exercise tonight. I'm gonna try to get some exercise tonight. I'm gonna try to get some exercise tonight. 오늘 밤에 운동 좀 하려고. I'm gonna try to get some exercise tonight. Okay, 이것도 여러 번 해볼게요. I'm gonna try to finish this book this week. I'm gonna try to finish this book this week. I'm gonna try to finish this book this week. Okay, you got over Gail. I'm gonna try to quit coffee. I'm gonna try to quit coffee. I'm gonna try to quit coffee. I'm gonna try to cook more. I'm gonna try to cook more. I'm gonna try to cut back on junk food. 이게 무슨 말이죠, 여러분? I'm gonna try to cut back on junk food. What does this mean? Uh, junk food. 불량식품을 좀 줄이려고. 나 불량식품 좀 줄여보려고. 그 얘기죠. 딱그 뉘앙스죠. 좀 그렇게 해보려고. 불량식품 좀 줄여보려고. Uh, I'm gonna try to cut back on junk food. Okay? 자, 그래서 I'm gonna try to. 진짜 그냥 평소에 진짜 많이 쓰는 패턴이야. I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try to do something. Okay? 그래서 지금까지 얘기했던 거 잠깐 다시 얘기해 볼게요. I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try to go to bed early today. I'm gonna try to get some exercise tonight. I'm gonna try to finish this book this week. I'm gonna try to quit coffee. I'm gonna try to cook more. Um, more often. 이라고 할까요? 좀 요리를 좀더 자주 해보려고. Um, from now on. 이렇게까지 해, 해볼까요? I'm gonna try to cook more often from now on. From now on이 무슨 말이죠? From now on? From, from now가 있어서 어, 지금부터 이거랑 아주 딱 맞는데 쉽기도 하면서 근데 어느 정도 그 의역이 되면은요 앞으로는 이, 이 말이랑도 잘 어울려요 이 의미를 충분히 가, 가지고 있어요, 오케이? Okay? 그래서 앞으로 요리를 좀더 자주 해보려고 오케이? Okay? 이런 식으로 얘기할 수 있겠죠 아, 앞으로 요리를 좀더 자주 해보려고 I'm gonna try to cook more often from now on I'm gonna try to cook more often from now on I'm gonna try to cook more often from now on. Okay, uh, 여러 번 따라할게요. I'm not sure if I can get there in time. I'm not sure if I can get there in time. I'm not sure if I can get there in time. 무슨 말이죠? What does it mean? I'm not sure if I can get there in time. 할수 있을지 모르겠어. 그 의미를 생각하면서요. I'm not sure if I can get there in time. I'm not sure if I can get there in time. I'm not sure if I can get there in time. Uh, on time과 in time은 다른데요. 일단은 너무 신경 쓰지 말고요. 왜냐면 중요한 건 지금 이거예요. I'm not sure if I can get there in time. 노란 부분을 활용해서 하얀 부분을 여러분이 채워 보세요. Give me some examples. I'm not sure if I can lose weight. I'm not sure if I can quit coffee. Very good. Uh, I'm not sure if I I'm not sure if he can quit smoking. Very good. Uh, I'm not sure if I can figure it out. Very good. 여러분 이게 무슨 뜻이에요? I'm not sure if I can figure it out. I'm not sure if I can figure it out. What does this mean? I'm not sure if I can figure it out. I'm not sure if I can figure it out. 알아낼 수 있을지 모르겠어도 되고요. 어, 해결할 수 있을지 지 모르겠어. 그게 어, 상황에 따라서는 해결하다라는 의미로도 쓰고 figure something out, figure it out. 근데 어떤 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 물음표인 것에 대해서 그것에 어, 그거를 해명할 수 있는 어떤 답, 어떤 뭐 설명이나 어떤 뭐 answer. 정답. 그런 거를 내가 알아낼 수 있을지 아, 모르겠다. 이런 의미로요. Okay? I'm not sure if I can figure it out. I'm not sure if I can figure it out. I'm not sure if I can improve my English anymore. I'm not sure if I can do this by myself. Very good. 
이거를 나 혼자서 할수 있을지 모르겠다. Very good. I'm not sure if I can make the extra time. Yeah. Okay. 그렇죠. 추가적으로 시간을 낼수 있을지 모르겠다. I'm not sure if I can make the extra time. I'm not sure if I can if I can visit my parents on Sunday. Okay. I'm not sure if 누가 지금 주어가 빠졌어요. I'm not sure if I can take care of your dog next. 어, 그렇죠. 아이가 그냥 누락됐네요. 네, okay. So I'm not sure if I can take care of your dog next Monday. Good. Good. I'm not sure if I can make it this time. Very good. Very this is very good. 이번에는 갈수 있을지 모르겠다. 이 얘기예요. I'm not sure if I can make it this time. 나 이번에 갈수 있을지 모르겠어. I'm not sure if I can uh, I'm not sure if I can make it this time. I'm not sure if I can eat it all by myself. Very good. Very good. I'm not sure if I can eat it all by myself. I'm not sure if I can keep your uh, keep my promise. I'm not sure 라고 해야죠. 아, 내가 약속을 지킬 수 있을지 모르겠다. 왜냐면 내가 어떤 약속을 했으면은 그 it's it's my promise. Okay? So I I'm, I'm not sure if I can keep my promise. I'm not sure if I can go out tonight. Good. I'm not sure if I can quit smoking this year. Good. I'm not sure if he's going to take our offer. Good. Yeah. I'm not sure if I can raise this cat. Very good. I'm not sure if I can eat this all at once. Very good. Very good. You got to eat it all at once. Very good. I'm not sure if I can buy that. Very good. Very good. Let's do a little bit of the 이걸 해석이 어떻게 되죠? 이 이거죠. 이거랑 비슷한 거죠. A가 B를 하기를 기다리고 있다라는 거죠. A가 B 하기를 기다리고 있다. For example, for example, I'm still waiting for the bank to call me. Okay? It's just a random example. I'm still waiting for the bank to call me. 은행에서 전화 오기를 아직 기다리고 있다. 좀더 단순하게는 I'm still waiting for John to call. 아직 존 전화를 기다리고 있다라는 얘기죠. Uh, I'm still waiting for him to come back home. Very good. I'm still waiting for him to come back home. 그가 집으로 돌아오기를 아직 기다리, 기다리는 중이다. I'm still waiting for him to come uh, come back home. I'm still waiting for him to come back home. I'm still waiting for him to come back home. I'm still waiting for you to say yes. Wow, okay. All right. So maybe you are talking to someone who has not given you an answer uh, for some kind of invitation or offer. 뭐 여러분이 뭔가를 제안을 했다거나 아니면 뭐 초대를 했는데 아직 uh, 확답을 안준 사람. Uh, waiting for you to uh, give us an answer. Uh, we라고 할까요? We're still waiting for you to give us an answer. Uh, 이렇게도 나올 수 있겠네요. 그렇죠? I'm still waiting for her to make the video. Okay. I'm still waiting for you to stop smoking. I'm still waiting for you to stop smoking. Quit smoking? I'm still waiting for uh, you to quit smoking. I'm, I'm waiting for uh, her to put out the cigarette. So I'm waiting for her to put out the cigarette. Uh, 그 담배를 끄기를 uh, 기다리고 있다. Very good. 간단하면서 아주 유용한 그런 예문이죠. I'm still waiting for her to make a decision. I'm still waiting for her to make a decision. 이거와 더불어서 I'm still waiting for her to make a decision. 또 좋고요. 이거를 보자마자 든 생각이 I'm still waiting for her to make up her mind. Uh, 이렇게도 얘기를 많이 하죠. I'm still waiting for her to make up her mind. 마음을 정하다? 이런 표현이 있네요. 우리말에. 갑자기 왜 이상하게 느껴지지? 마음을 정하다? 있어요. 그런 표현이 있어요. Uh, anyway, so I'm still waiting for her to make up, uh, make up her mind. Hey, so what are you gonna do? 야, 그래서 어떻게 할 거야? 그거죠? 야, 그래서 어떻게 할 거야? Hey, so what are you gonna do? 야, 그래서 어떻게 할 거야? We're all, we're all still waiting for you to make up your mind. 너가 빨리 어, 마음 정하기를 다들 기다리고 있어. 왜 얘기죠? Hey, so what are you gonna do? We're all still waiting for you to make up your mind. Uh, we're, I'm still waiting for her to call me. I'm still waiting for the delivery to pick up the food. 식당 사장님이 하는 말이에요. Mm, okay. I'm still waiting for you to clean the room. Good. Good. I'm still waiting for you to clean the room. 만사 형통님 왜 이렇게 오랜만인 것 같지? I'm still waiting for my phone to be fixed. Very good. 맨 마지막에 어, 수동태를 쓰시긴 했는데 어쨌든 잘하셨어요. I'm still waiting for my phone to be fixed. 만사 형통님 진짜 오랜만이지 않아요? 
어, 아니요. 그렇게는 보통 얘기를 안 해요. 그러니까 하, 하기 할 수는 있거든요. 그게 이례적으로는 이례적으로는 그렇게 어, 하기도 하는데 일반적으로는 그렇게 하지 않죠. I'm still waiting for you to love me. Oh, I know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to think of this. 이거에 대해서 어떻게 생각해야 되는 거죠? 네, 이거 좋죠. It's a good example. I'm still waiting for my kids to come home. Very good. Very good. I'm still waiting for me to be discharged. No. 이런 경우는요. 미가 아니죠. 그냥 I'm still waiting to be 바로 그냥 for me 빼고요. I'm still waiting to be discharged. Uh, from the, from the from the army. For me, 빼고요. 바로 to be로 넘어가요. I'm still waiting to be discharged from the army. 자, 누구한테 전화가 왔다. 누구한테 문자가 왔다. 누구한테 이메일이 왔다. 이런 얘기를요. 왔다라는 식으로 표현하기보다는 I got라고 표현을 많이 해요. A call came, a message came이라고 할 수는 있어요. 근데 일반적으로는 이렇게 많이 얘기를 해요. I got a call. from 누구 I got a message from 누구 I got an email from 누구 So I got a call from my friend 자 이것도 좋은데요 저는 웬만하면 이제 친구에 대해서 얘기를 하면은요 I got a call from a friend라고 해요 저는 보통 a friend라고 해요 여기서 소유격을 잘안 쓰는데 그 이유가요 uh, My friend라고 하면은요 마치 친구가 그한 명뿐인 것처럼 들릴 수가 있어요 약간 그런 이제 애매한 뉘앙스가 있어요 그래서 a friend A friend라고 해야 어, 친구 한 명한테서 친구가 여러 명이 있는데 그 중에 한 명한테서 이제 왔다. 어느 친구 한 명으로부터 전화가 왔다. 그쵸? I got a call from an agency. Okay, that's good. Um, 도레미님. I got an email from my boss. Very good. I got a call from my boss. Yes, very good. I got a call from my boss. I got a call from my husband. Mm -hmm. I got a text message from my neighbor. Okay. Good. I got a text message from my neighbor. Uh, 이웃, 그, 이웃으로, 이웃한테 문자가 왔다. I got a call from the hospital. Very good. Yes. I got a call from the hospital. Good. Very good. I got, I got an email from the head office. The, the head office. I got an email from an old friend. We hadn't been in touch for a couple of years. Very good. Good example. 뒷부분은 좀 어려우실 거예요. 토들러 분들은요. I got a call from her. Uh, that was so horrible. It it was so horrible. Got the other job. That was gone. It it was so horrible. I'm not sure if I can keep in touch with her. Ooh, okay. Um, good example. I got an email from an old friend. Good. I got an email from an old friend. I got a call from a friend. If I got ready to enjoy the party. 이런 식이었어요. 뭐 party 부분은 이제 어, 제가 뺐는데 무슨 의미인지 아시죠? 무슨 말을 하고 싶었던 건지 아시죠? 그쵸? 내가 준비됐냐고 친구한테 전화가 왔었어. 이거죠? 이거죠? 그쵸? asking만 넣어, 들어가면 돼요. me도 없어도 돼요. 그냥 asking만 들어가면 돼요. I got a call from a friend asking if I was ready. I got a call from a friend asking if I was ready. 어, 친구로, 친구한테 준비가 됐냐고 전화가 왔어. 이 얘기죠. 아주 편하게 말을 하면 그냥 이 정도로 얘기할 수 있을까요? 우리말로. 괜찮아요. 이 정도면은. 아, 친구한테 준비됐냐고 전화가 왔어. 왔었어. 왔었어? 왔었어랑 왔어가 뭐가 차이, 무슨, 어. 전화가 끊은 상태면은 왔었어고, 지금도 아직 그 통화가 이어지고 있으면 왔어도 맞네요. 그쵸? So I got a call from a friend asking if I was ready. Asking if까지 한번 해볼까요? I got a call 또는 message. From 누구? Asking. If. 이거 가지고 해보세요. 이 뒷부분은 여러분이 채워보세요. I got a message asking if I can make it tomorrow. Good. From who? From who? I got a call from my friend asking if I would run in a marathon. Okay. Good. Uh, 저라면은요. If I would 보다는 여기에 약간 더 덧붙여서 If I would like to 라고 했을 것 같아요. If I would like to run in a marathon. I got a call from my friend Asking if I would like to, if I would like to run in a marathon. I got a call from a mom asking if I was ready. 어느 한 엄마요? 아 uh, 만약에요, 그 이거를 말하는 사람이 어린이집 직원이다, 사장님이다. 그러면은 가능은 해요. 근데 내 엄마면은 I got a call from mom이에요, 그냥 mom. I got a call from mom asking if I was ready. A mom, 아니고요, mom. I got a message from my mom asking if I had dinner. Very good. 
Very, very good. I got a call from my mom asking if I can get some bread. Get 도 좋고요. Pick up 도 좋아요. Pick up some bread. I got a call from my mom asking if I could um, pick up some bread. 집에 오는 길에 어떻게 얘기하죠? 이거 어떻게 얘기하죠? On my way home. Very good. On my way home. 몇번 읽어볼게요. I got a call from my mom uh, asking if I could pick up some bread on my way home. I got a call from my mom asking if I could pick up some bread on my way home. 자, 근데 여러분, 이 my 있죠? 이 my가 없어야 하는 경우가 있어요. 그게 어떤 경우게요? 어떤 경우게요? my가 없어야 하는 경우는 어떤 경우게요? 그쵸? 가족한테 얘기할 때. 식구끼리. Exactly. 형제, 자매 또는 어, 아빠한테 얘기할 때는 어, my가 아니죠. 뭐 심지어 친척까지도 포함이에요. 친척까지도 my를 생략하는 게 맞아요. 그런데 어, 이제 친구, 뭐 회사 동료, 아, 이, 뭐 이웃 뭐 이렇게 되면 은 이제 마이가 들어가는 거고요. I got a call from my mom asking if I could pick up some bread on my way home. I got a call from my old, from an old friend, my 말고요, an old friend, an old friend asking if I could borrow some money. Um, borrow랑 랜드가 또 헷갈리시는구나. I got a message. I got a call now. I got a call from an old friend. Asking if I could lend him, don't her, some money. Okay, you go. I got a call from an old friend asking if I could lend him some money. Don't know if I can lend her some money. Uh, borrow는 빌리다예요. 빌리다니까 I 하고 borrow가 되면은 내가 빌리는 거예요. Okay, 근데 나는 빌려 주는 입장이어야 되니까 lend가 돼야 돼요. I got a call from an old friend asking if I could lend him some money. Lend her some money. I got a call from my apartment manager asking if I was satisfied with their repair. Good. 그냥 최근 거부터 한번 몇 개만 더 볼게요. I got a call from a friend asking if I have time to meet uh, to meeting on Saturday. Got a call from a friend asking uh, if I had time on Saturday. 그냥 이렇게요. 이렇게 얘기를 하던가 꼭 uh, 노, 그러니까 만날 시간 되느냐 만날 수 있는 시간이 되느냐 꼭 그거를 넣어야 된다면 uh, if I had time to to hang out on Saturday 이렇게 할 수는 있어요 I got a call from a friend asking if I had time to hang out on Saturday okay I got a call from a friend asking if I could have lunch together this weekend if I could 보다는 if I could 보다는 I got a call from a friend Asking if I wanted to have lunch uh, with her this weekend. 저라면 이렇게 얘기를 할 거예요. If I if I could가 아니라 점심을 같이 먹을 수 있는지보다는 uh, 먹겠냐고 먹고 싶냐고. If I wanted to 이렇게 저라면 할 거예요. I got a call from a friend asking if I wanted to have lunch with her this weekend. I got a message from the delivery guy asking if the date could be pushed back a little. Very good. Very good. Very, very good. A little hard for toddlers, but very, very good. I got a call from a friend um, asking if I could see her tomorrow morning. Asking in 빠졌죠? 그렇죠? 그냥 순간적으로 누락된 것 같아요. I got a call from a friend asking if I could see her tomorrow morning. Good. Very good. Very, very, uh, asking 하나만 들어가면 좋겠네요. I got a message from someone at work asking if I could get to work a little earlier tomorrow. Perfect. Perfect. It looks good. Yeah, that's good. I'm not sure if I can review what we learned tonight. Why not? You don't have time? I got a message from an old friend asking if I remembered him. So I answered him that I, uh, answered him 말고 그냥 told him 이라고 하는 게 좋아요. 그때는. I told him that I was still waiting for him. 지금 유라고 하시면은 저를 얘기를 하는 거예요. Uh, I got a message from my sister that my mom got us good surgery. Sister saying that um, mom's surgery turned out great. 그냥 간단하게 mom's surgery was uh, successful라고 해도 되긴 해요. 
I shouldn't have had dinner today. I shouldn't have had dinner today. I shouldn't have had dinner today. I shouldn't have 하면 하지 말걸 하지 말았어야 했는데 I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have had. I shouldn't have had. I shouldn't have had. I shouldn't have had dinner today. I shouldn't have had dinner today. 오늘 저녁 먹지 말걸. 하, 오늘 저녁 먹지 말았어야 했는데. I shouldn't have had dinner today. I shouldn't have dated him. Good. Good. 걔랑 사귀지 말 걔랑 사귀지 말걸. 걔랑 사귀는 게 아니었는데. 약간 이런 말투인가요? 아, 걔랑 사귀는 게 아니었는데. I shouldn't have dated him. I shouldn't have dated him. Uh, I shouldn't have sold my car. Good. I shouldn't have I shouldn't have sold my car. I shouldn't have sold my car. 여러분 지금 발음하고 계시는 거죠? 쓰기만 하는 게 아니라 I shouldn't have sold my car. I shouldn't have started smoking. I shouldn't have started smoking. Good. I shouldn't have bought the sweater. Good. 그 스웨터를 사지 말걸. 사지 말았어야 했는데. I shouldn't have bought the sweater. I shouldn't have taken the offer. 그 제안을 uh, 받아들이지 말걸. I shouldn't have taken the offer. 만약에 여러분이 어떤 얘기를 했는데 어떤 얘기를 했는데 그, 그 말, 말투가 당시에는 내가 좀 너, 굉장히 속상하고 좀 화도 나고 나서 말을 좀 약간 좀 그렇게 좀 그렇고 그렇게 했어요. 이거는 내용 전달을 한 것에 문제가 아니죠. 말을 어떻게 했는지 문제죠. 그 이거예요. I shouldn't have said that to him. 그 내용을 그 사람한테 전달하지 말거리면은 I shouldn't. 아 잠깐만요. Shouldn't have. I shouldn't have told him. I shouldn't have told him. I shouldn't have hired him. Good. Good example. I shouldn't have hired him. You should have listened to me. Very good. Very very good. You should have listened to me. 내 말을 들었었어야지 이거죠. You should have listened to me. 네말 들을 걸. I should have listened to you. I should have listened to you. He should have listened to his wife. Okay. Yeah. He should have listened to his wife. Uh, I should have taken your advice. Uh, 네 조언대로 할 걸. I'm so starving. I should have eaten something before I watched this live stream. Very good. Uh, 맨 마지막 부분이 약간 아쉽긴 하지만 before, uh, before I joined this live stream, Ming, ING 말고요. Before I, I joined this live stream, 이렇게 요 I'm so starving, starving. I should have eaten something before I, uh, I joined this live stream. Uh, 지금 이런 식으로 약간의 맥락을 이렇게 더하는 거 아주 좋은 거예요. Uh, I'm so starving. I should have eaten something before joining the live stream. I still have to. I still have to do what? 아직 해야 할 일이 남아 있을 때. 지금 이게 해석이 아니고요. 이럴 때 쓰는 말. I still have to do something. 뭐 예를 들어서 I still have to do uh, a few more sets. 아직 몇 세트를 더 해야 된다. 아직 몇 세트 남았어. 이런 얘기를 left로 굳이 하지 않고 이렇게 하는 것도 아주 자연스러워요. I still have to do a few more sets. 그쵸? 이런 거예요. I still have to do the dishes. I still have to do the laundry. Yes. I still have to send some emails. 그냥 send emails 보다는 send some. 또는 few 약간 그런 한정사가 약간씩 들어가 주는 게더 자연스러워요. I still have to send a few emails. I still have to send a couple of emails. I still have to send some emails. Okay. I still have to learn more. Okay. I still have to do homework. Okay. I still have to eat dessert. <laughs> 뭔가 항상 예문의 선택이 도레미님은 it's it's interesting. Uh, I still have to get used to this workplace. Okay. Very good. Yeah. I still have to get used to this workplace. Mm -hmm. 아직 어, 적응이 덜 됐다. 아직 적응을 덜, 더 해야 된다. 그 얘기죠. Very good. This is a very good, um, very good example. How did you come up with this? 이거 어떻게 생각해 주셨어요? I still have to get used to this workplace. 아직 그 직장에 적응을 좀더 해야 된다. I still have to prepare more food for my guests. Okay. I still have to lose some more weight. Very good. Very good. 만사형태님. I still have to lose some more weight. Uh, 이렇게 
lose 보세요. 여러분 잘 보세요. 그냥 lose weight가 아니라 some more 이런 식으로 약간의 그 이걸 한정사라고 하는 게 맞나요? 이걸 좀 이렇게 같이 써주는 게 보통 저 자연스러워요. 안 쓰는 것보다는 이, 이것보다는 이것보다는 I still have to lose weight 보다는 좀더 이런 식으로 I still have to lose some more weight. Ah, here's something interesting. I still have to think about that some more. Good. Good. 그거에 대해서는 좀더 고민을 해봐야 돼. 그거에 대해서는 아직 좀더 고민을 필요한 것 같아. 아, 아직 좀더 고민이 필요해. 아직 좀더 고민을 해봐야 돼. 이런 느낌으로 I still have to think about that some more. 전체적으로 한번 볼까요? I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try to. I'm not sure if. I'm not sure if I can. 여기까지요. I'm not sure if I can. 할수 있을지 확실하지 않다. 잘 모르겠다. 할수 있을지 잘 모르겠다. Okay? I'm not sure if I can. I'm still waiting for A to do B. A가 B를 하기를 나는 아직도 기다리고 있다. 이 still은 사실 옵션이에요. still가 항상 있어야 되는 건 아니에요. 그냥 한번 넣어봤어요. I got a call from. I got a message from. I got an email from 누구? I got a call from a friend. I got a call from a friend. 그러면서 우리가 asking to 붙였어요. 예, 사실 오늘 이것까지 안할 생각이었는데 근데 제가 항상 강조하는 거 있죠? 어렵더라도 우리가 평소에 많이 쓰는 말이라면 시간을 들여서 배워야 돼요. 그 다음에 should have, shouldn't have. 마지막으로 I still have to. 아직도 뭔가 할 일이 남았을 때. 